All right, now with the Albed Sykes up to level 101. Jumping through. We've claimed victory. We've claimed a win. We've got some hope back in our lives. <laughs> but going through, we have Sphere Shot, Nap Shot, Wither Shot on Dotto. Nothing on Waka looks like. Our main hope might be Dotto. I guess let's let's jump in and see what we can do. I think do we... Okay, they do have Anti-Nap and full Anti-Wither on, on Nimrok. We might have to just hope for the best. Perfect. And then, as, as you all know, the Albed Sykes losing the game do go up a level. Uh, they specifically go to level 101. Uh, in terms of stat changes, I know a lot of people are curious about it. Interesting. I think interesting stat changes. Uh, not a lot changes. Wake M and Judah get more block, which is cool. Uh, Blapa and Eager each lose a pass. I think it's like Blapa goes from 37 to 36, and then... Um, Eager from 47 to 46. I could have that switched. But they, they lose stats. Oh yeah, Eager from 47 to 46. He's got 46 pass there. So, I mean, pass is not the predominant, like, main feature of a forward. That's not something we look at as, like, oh, like, that's that's why they're good, you know? But what I would argue is that's that could be a sign of the future, and that could be a very good thing for us. If we beat them and they lose stats, oh, it's that is a landslide waiting to happen. That's all that is. Gonna go for the Wither Tackle 3. Unfortunately, unable to touch Blapa. Blapa gonna go for the pass here. Gonna get over Letty, but Waka gets the block. Let's go for the Auto Counter. I think that makes sense. I feel pretty good about it. That's weird. Maybe I should pass to Dotto, or sorry, Letty, uh, because of the Nat Pass too. I'm I'm really just trying to figure this out to be honest. It's it's hard to determine like what what actually makes sense here. What can we really do to to succeed? The sleep is there. That's beautiful. Really, my goal here is I want to pass the Dotto and I want him to have a chance, but I want to put the opponent in a situation where if they pass the ball out. Then they're going to, um, oh, this isn't going to work at all. Yeah, this is clearly not working too well yet. Okay, there it is. Uh, but I don't want to put them in a situation where they pass to a sleeping person and we get the ball back. I want to put them in a, in a situation of defeat, you know? I mean, it just makes sense, you know? It's, uh, well, why would we not want to do that? The one negative with this push is Eager is very close to Dotto now, and that, and that makes me nervous. That makes me a little bit scared for the future. I don't want to have a situation where Dotto's got to deal with two people. There's a good chance Dotto can't even deal with the one defender he has. There's a very good chance of that. I'm gonna pass to Letty. I think this will bait Eager, and he'll push on Letty. I think. Yeah. See, we're doing it. We're killing it, man. We're absolutely killing it. Gonna go for the auto counter. Three minutes in, I think we just go for our uh, our fancy little little sphere shot. I would say Wake Am is far enough away that we can pass the Dotto. He takes the hit from Judah, survives, scores a goal, and we live happily ever after. That's the motto. That's the goal. I don't like how we moved, but sure. Um, it's greedy for me to dribble after this. Okay, we're doing it. Insane sphere shot. Let's go. That is not an insane sphere shot. That is a very bad sphere shot. Ah, Wakeham gets it too. I don't really expect Waka to succeed if he gets the ball there, but he could. I mean, his shoot would have been higher than Dotto's, even without a technique, because Dotto's shoot is so bad. It is so low. You know, it's maybe? <gasps> Dude, this could be it. This could be gold. We're gonna go auto counter. We got 50 seconds, something like that. I think we gotta go for it. I think we just we just send it. No one in front of us. 63. That's good, but 68's better. Can't we get lucky though? No. Nimrick with the block. Passes to Judah. See, that's the problem, right? 
we're point blank, we're holding Nimrook's hand with Waka, and it's not enough. It doesn't matter. We still fail. Gonna have Judah pass to Barrack. This could be big. And it's 0 0 second half. Same deal. No, no shoot techniques for Waka. That is a bummer. Same everything, really. My goodness. I guess we really gotta just go through this with the struggle of. You know, having 63 shoot on Waka and then playing the game of does our does our sphere shot do more with Dotto? I don't know, man. All right, well, we're going to auto counter. Starting with the ball is superb. I did see that we keep the nap pass too. I didn't actually check the opponent's um, anti-nap status. They could have adjusted. They could be immune. But we'll pass to um, Jasu. Pass back to Letty. You know, we're just... Essentially, Nat Pass 3 was a guarantee, like, monstrous action. Nat Pass 2 does not have that guarantee. Um, we still go for the same strategy. It just takes more time. Um, which is which is good. Like, that is a good bad thing, right? Because I, it's failed twice. And I, I'm, I'm running down the clock of time I have to score. So, this could be bad for our team. Um, and now can I even get him back in the encounter? See? Like, this is... This is an additional struggle. Additional struggle is good for us. I mean, if we had not passed three, we would have had all three of them slept by now. It would have been too much. Too powerful. But yeah, we're going to have Jossie with the ball. We're going to go for the auto counter. Pass to Letty here. Uh, I think we can get him. Nice. That's what we care about. And Blappa, it, he, he's immune. It just doesn't trigger. Can you imagine if it triggers and then he, uh... Oh, this is scary. I'm going to throw the game. Wake well, certainly encounters on this. <gasps> she doesn't. That's crazy. This this might be a weird thing to bring up, but... Like, in moments like that... Okay, I don't know. Blappa's not going to be slept. Got it. Um, but in moments like that, I almost feel like I have to stop talking to, like, focus. It's the equivalent of, like, <laughs> I don't know if anyone else does this. But it's like when you're driving, and then it's like, turn down the radio. I need to, like, I need to pay attention to these street signs. It's like, I mean, you know, you don't, you don't really, like, you know, use your ears for the street signs. But it's like a focus thing. I don't know, it's weird. Okay, 70 is big. 70 is big. Come on, Nimra. Fail, fail, fail. There it is. Dotto is our hero. How, why, why did I ever forsake him? Why did I ever forsake him? Dotto, the champion. A sphere shot for the ages. 70 shoot goes in. I mean, you see the leftover shoot. So I think I think what that means is the bare minimum we could have shot with is 65. Uh, Waka's shoot is at 63. So there was no natural way for us to score there in any world. Okay, honestly, missing this tackle doesn't seem like a big deal, but it is. Um, what happens here a lot is they... Well, we, we score, right? We score, we have a good time. And then they just spend like a few seconds, get a goal, and then crush us. And we're trying to avoid that. Um, Dotto with the ball is actually superb. We're going to go for the auto counter. This might be really greedy considering the time left in the game, but I'm going to go for it. I think I can do it. No! I thought I could do it. I thought I could just encounter Judah and then push forward with for a free uh, for a free attempt on goal. Cause I knew I was gonna encounter Judah. I just didn't think Barrick would show up too. The sphere shot here is purely to kill the clock. Cause when it's a sphere shot, Barrick blocks it. The spin ball happens. Uh, Waka gets it. Sure. Wait, this is actually superb for killing time. And then this might seem weird, but. We're going to pass to uh, no one because we're going to lose the ball. Um, we were in a position where um, Waka was cutting into the goal. But as he was cutting, you could see that Barrick was going to encounter him. 
and we didn't want to make the same mistake twice, so we we're going to pass to Dotto and have him going for the sphere shot. Although it required 65 shoot last time to score, I still think that sphere shot was a little bit of a miracle. And even though I said we should not have forsaken Dotto, I did kind of think we should try with Waka. Even though he's failed so many times. Time and time again, Waka fails us. Alright, well, Lake Cam's going to go for the shot. And honestly, I mean, hot take, this is curtains. Like, it's over. She can't score. Uh, we'll get the ball back. There's 15 seconds. The pass will go to doesn't matter who. Um, perfect. This marks the second win in a row. A certified win streak has started. The Albert Sykes won four or five games in a row. Now they're up to level 102. We got a hot streak going, and we're not stopping. If their stats decrease, we're throwing a party. We're throwing a party. This is perfect. All right. Well, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And when you come back, going to be playing more Blitzball. Until next time.